Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Shayla here. So today's a little bit different. I feel like I'm constantly getting asked questions from what underwear do I wear to how do I, how do I do this, how to do that. And so I'm like, let me make a video and just give you guys some tips on how to slay. Okay guys, tip number one. This is very, very important, especially for those of you who wear dresses, wear bodycon dresses, wear, shoot, jumpsuits even. You guys need a pair of Spanx. So these are the Spanx that I wear. I have both nude and black. I'll show you the black one. Wait, do these have a hole? Oh my God, you guys, my nails, when I tell you they go through these, you gotta be careful. So these are the shorts. They're super thin material. They're actually the Spanx brand, you guys. So they come up to my belly button, I would say. And then the shorts, I would say, go maybe like three inches down my thigh, essential. So with Spanx, you guys, because I know a lot of you have so many questions about this. You do not wear underwear under them, okay? Put the Sphinx on, put your dress on, no underwear. I know it sounds weird, but these are, they're kind of like an underwear, you know, and they snatch you up. I am so sick of seeing underwear lines, you guys. We need to get it together. We can do better, okay? No, but for real, no more underwear lines. Okay, I don't wanna see them. I don't wanna see the crease from the underwear, nada. I don't know if it sounded harsh, but you guys, I'm trying to give you guys information. I want you guys all to look good. I want you guys to slay. Oh, by the way, I have a shirt on, okay? It's just, it's strapless, so. I don't want you guys to think I'm out here thotting and bopping, you know, cause I'm not. Okay, tip number two, you guys. When you wanna do a daytime slay and you're wearing glasses, these are my Desi, uh, which one are these? High key glasses. So what I do is when I'm driving to my destination, I do not have the glasses on when I have makeup on, okay? When I get to my destination, so say I'm like outdoors, having lunch or brunch, you wanna put them on at the very, 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 I guess as low as they can go, right about here. I would keep them on for about 10 minutes at a time and then take them off. That way your, your nose can breathe and you don't get those crazy lines. That's a, that's a, that's a major, I don't wanna say major key because that's so played out, but that's a major tip, guys. Glasses on just for a little bit. Take them off, let your skin breathe, then you can put them back on. I honestly, if I'm wearing makeup, I don't like to wear glasses for too long. Like, I'll just have them on for a little bit and then take them off, you know, because I hate the crease from the glasses. Okay, so tip number three, keep your nails polished. So I know there's a lot of you out there who maybe can't afford nail polish, but you can afford, and I know this for a fact, because if you're watching this video, buying makeup, you can afford this, get a little buffer, okay? And you can just have a clear coat, okay? Otherwise, if you can paint your nails yourself, make sure that your nails stay polished, okay? This could be a clear coat, it could be a nude. You just never wanna have those fingers with the dirt underneath it and look a hot mess, okay? You guys, these are, these are essential tips to slay. I'm just saying. Okay guys, so I'm gonna stop naming the tips because I feel like I'm gonna get to a point where I'm gonna forget and be like tip number 10 and I'll say it like five times. Tip number 10. So when taking a selfie, you guys, it's very, very essential, very important, you guys, that when you're taking a selfie that you're facing the light, okay? I can't tell you this enough. If you guys have seen my Snapchat, you've seen me, hashtag Shayla taught you, okay? You've seen me teach you how to take a selfie. So say I'm taking a selfie, I'm looking at myself, the light has to be hitting my face, okay? You can't be like this with all this light back here trying to take a selfie, it's just not gonna come out clear. It's not gonna be cute, okay? You wanna take a selfie if you can in front of natural light. If you can't, make sure the lighting is, is LED so it doesn't look orange, it looks nice and crisp and clear. One more trick, you guys, when taking a selfie, see how I don't really have it down here? Cause that's just like, it's not good for the neck. You know, I have it up here, like way up here, not up here. Okay, I, you shouldn't have to see your water line, like right about eye level, slightly tilted down. So this is the phone straight, okay? Slightly tilted down. Okay, this is how you wanna take your selfie. Before you take the selfie, this is very important. You touch the screen, so it'll focus on your face, and then bam, bam, bam. You just slay the picture. It's that easy, guys, I promise. <laughs> well, maybe it's not quite that easy, but if you practice, you'll get it, okay? One more thing, when doing the duck lip, cause we all do it, let's be honest. So say I'm taking a selfie and I'm like, okay, let me pout my lips. 
Well, let's be clear. There's a difference between the pout and the duck lip, okay? The duck lip is this. That's not cute. You guys, we can't do it. We can't do it anymore, okay? You just gotta slightly pout your lip. So when, you, when you're taking a picture, just kind of like barely, okay? See, I'm like barely doing it. So this is normal. And then this is the pout. Barely, okay? Another tip when taking a selfie, there's something that I like to do. It's not the smize, but it's like, it's like resting bitch face, but you're kind of smiling. So this is normal. And then the resting bitch face, I'll slightly squint my eyes and then I'll, I'll smile like a millimeter, just a millimeter. So this is it. That way your lips kind of tilt up a little bit. I know I'm getting technical, but there's an art to it. I'm trying to help you guys out, okay? <laughs> so you could either do the pout, you could barely smile, or there's one more, the look away, okay? I feel like I used to do this in all my pictures. So the camera's here, but I'm looking this way. So the camera's here, but I'm looking straight. And you can't look at something close because then you'll look cross-eyed. You have to look at something far away. Like, so say you guys are my phone. I would just go like this. You're welcome. That's all I'm saying. You're welcome, okay? So for those of you who are like, okay, I've gotten this down. I want a nicer camera. I want better pictures. I've said this before. You guys need to get the Sony A5100. So I broke my Sony about a week ago, a week ago. No, I'm just kidding. It was like a couple months ago. And I went and got a new lens. They didn't have the lens that it came with. So I got this one, which I think it's like a 0.29 millimeter. I don't know if that even makes sense. Two by 28, that's what the lens says. So see how it's like a little bit longer? So this is actually, I like this better for selfies because it's a little bit crisper, you know? I like it for outfit pictures. This is like pretty much what I use all the time. Also, the A5100 has a flip screen. So when you're taking your selfie, you can see yourself. The only thing with this lens is, guys, it's because it's long, it zooms in. So you kind of have to like either use a tripod stand or hold your arm out like hella far. You know what I'm saying? But you guys need, it, need this if you're trying to get to the next level of slayage of that selfie slayage, you know? I'm just here trying to help you guys, okay? One more thing. When it comes to the slay, okay? First things first, sit up straight, you guys. I know you guys are probably watching this like for real, yes. Like if, you, if you're sitting up straight, you just look more confident. You just look like you're just like serving, you know? And then it makes your face just look better, like you're serving face and body. Even when you walk into the club, the restaurant, the bar, the school, wherever you're going, make sure you're standing up straight, sitting up straight. It just looks better, you guys. It's, it's one more tip to help you slay. Okay, that's all I'm saying. I'm trying to help you guys slay. That's it. Okay, guys, the last tip I'm going to give you to slay. Don't worry, I'm going to have another video with even more tips, but the last tip of today is encourage your friends, okay? So say you see someone, you guys are taking your OTDs or whatnot, and you could see one of your friends is just kind of like not feeling it, encourage her, be like, yes, dang, ooh, ooh. You know, you have to, you have to throw out those encouraging words. However you want to say it, my whole thing is yes, slay. You know, that way if they're taking a picture, they're going to kill it. They're going to slay. Not only when they're taking a picture, but... Just like when you see them, if you see your friend and she's slaying, tell them, be like, ooh, that's cute. Ooh, your hair looks cute. Ooh, your makeup is fire. Ooh, that skirt is booming. Those shoes are popping. Encourage your friends, you guys, because that just helps you slay harder. And you guys want to slay as a group, okay? You want to slay as a unit. You want everyone on the squad to be booming, okay? Oh, that's another thing. I said that was my last tip, but this is actually my last tip, you guys. I promise you guys, if you're in a group of girls that you love to hang out with, don't try and be in competition with them. Try and slay as hard as them or slay together. Do you know what I'm saying? So if you have a friend and you feel like, okay, she should brush her hair or she should do this or that, tell her, give her some, give her a brush, damn it, something. You know what I'm saying? Or if you feel like, if you and a friend wear the same shoe size and you're like, dang, I have a pair of shoes that will look better. Let her borrow your shoes. 
Be a good friend. That way you guys are just slaying together. You know? The whole group needs to be Metro Boomin. That's all I'm saying. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope you learned some tips on how to slay, how to perfect that selfie, how to help your friends out, how to wear Spanx. Listen, that was major right there. Also, don't forget that if you're slaying, your friends all need to be strutting and slaying together, okay? Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, guys. Comment below. I wanna know what you think when I'm talking to you and not doing a makeup tutorial, because this is a little different. Um, and last but not least, strut and slay.